Hi, Cancer. This is Born What Avail. This is your rest of your reading for May, May the 17th to May the 31st. If you'd like a personalized reading, please contact me at bornwithavail at yahoo.com. I do private videos for 65, 20 minutes for 25, and I do tarot cards, a video for 50. So here we go. You got the two of coins upside down. Um... You're going to have to learn how to handle matters. You're going to have to start dealing with your own shit in the way that you feel fit. Because it's like everybody has given up. Um, it's going to be enforced on you, Cancer. You're going to get some type of letter or message. When you do, you're going to, get, you're going to have strength about this. Um, you're going to overcome anything that comes your way. Uh, relationships, family, friends, whoever it may be. Uh, Nine of Cups. You've made a lot of mistakes and you've lost a lot of things. Um, there is misplaced truth within you. There's a lot of lies, fantasies. You're not telling the truth about some things. And you feel caged in. That's why you have false freedom. You're getting into disputes and differences because you're lying. You're not telling the truth about some stuff. You need to start telling the truth. Uh, within your family, relationships, friendships. Death. You got the death card. You're getting ready to make a big change in your life. Transformation. Clearing away the old to make way for the new. You're getting rid of people. And if you have to step all over them to do it, you will. You're making an abrupt change. Um... You could possibly get sick. Be careful of that. Entertainment purposes only, but you could come down with something. Um, loss of financial security. There's no money. There's there's nothing there. Uh, this is not going to resonate with everyone, every cancer, but with some. Um, some of you are just throwing your money away. You made bad in investments. Mostly cancers, a lot of cancers are very good with money, um, very good with everything. They own property, they own vehicles, they got good jobs. So this is not going to resonate with every cancer. Three of Swords, you're very disappointed. You got a lot of sorrow cancer, some of you. Cross Watchers, um, if you're with a cancer, maybe you could be causing this sorrow. Um, there is a separation with someone that you do love and care about. I feel like some of you do cry. Um, you're very unhappy at this time and there's a lot of grief. The fool. Some of you are making really bad choices, cancers. You are in a relationship, indecision. Um, you don't know whether to proceed or not. Uh, the two of wands. Um, some of you are very macho, but you've lost the faith. Um, there's a lot of sadness around you, trouble. You feel that other people are causing you shit. No, you're causing your own. Like I say, cancers are good people. They're very loving and very kind, but a lot of cancers are sneaky. They don't tell the truth. They hide shit. That one maybe little bit of truth that means something to somebody, you hide it. you got to stop lying so much. The hangman. Um, you're going through a transition. You're going through a change. The universe has forced this upon you. Everything that you're going through, negative, positive, good or bad, the universe is making you go through it. A lot of you are bored. A lot of you feel abandoned. A lot of you feel like you've sacrificed a lot, nothing in return. Uh, the Four of Wands. You're very romantic, Cancer. Very passionate, romantic Good in bed, sex, sexual stimulation, very good. Good kissers. Um, but you like the peace and tranquility around you, too. But you, Cancer, you got to offer that peace and tranquility. I can't never get that word out uh, with your partner. There is going to be a union with you and your loved one. Uh, ten of coins. Somehow, someone's going to pass around you, Cancer, but 
or someone that's dealing with a cancer. Like your mother or father is a cancer, grandmother is a cancer. There's not going to be an inheritance for you. And that's going to piss you off. Three of coins. You're very good, Cancer, in, in what you do. Your work is outstanding. You're a perfectionist when it comes to a lot of things. Um, you got the king of coins. There's corruption all around you. And you're not being faithful, um, Cancer, some of you. You're not being you're not being uh faithful. Faithful means when you're in a relationship cancer all water signs when you're in a relationship that means you don't talk to other people you don't flirt it's okay to look not too long of course you'll get the shit knocked out of you by your mate but my point is you've some of you got the perfect mate or you got your eyes on the perfect mate or you're engaged or married to the perfect mate but you still look I mean if you have everything you want in that person, why are you still looking? Why are you cheating? Why are you doing the shit undercover if that's what you want, Cancer? I don't get it. Not all Cancers, but some. The sun. Um, you're not happy. You feel very lonely at this time. You feel like if you're engaged or marriage, you feel like the marriage is broken or the engagement is broken. It's canceled. Um, right now, you don't have a lot of friendships. Some of you uh, Cancers, not all. Uh, the Page of Swords. Uh, an imposter will be revealed to you. Cancer. I'm telling you. You got something like a Scorpio. I mean, you got to watch so you don't get sick. Seriously. And you're really not prepared for anything. You're like the wind right now. You go in any direction that the wind blows. Get it together, Cancer. Uh, Page of Swords. Um... You want to recover what is lost within your relationship because you really do care about this person. You really do love this person. But I also see you physically fighting. Two males, a male and a female. Brother and sister, lover, husband, wife, whoever. I see a fight getting ready. To, I see all shit getting ready to break loose. Uh, five of Swords. You're so tired, Cancer. You're just tired of everything. And um, I hate to say this, but I just told Scorpio this and another sign, entertainment purposes only, but someone's getting ready to pass around you this year and next year. You're just fucking worn out, mentally and physically. And there's a possible misfortune there. You might not get an inheritance. Um, siblings might get something, but I don't really see you getting too much. There's really nothing to give. So you better get your life in order and figure out what the heck you're going to do real quick, Cancer. Um, the Page of Wands. You don't, you, there's an indecision there. You don't know whether to go on, to sit back, or what are you going to do? You don't know. you got to make some decisions. A lot of gossip going around you, just like I told Scorpio. You're very displeased. Uh, six of Coins. Your future. Um, you do have two children, uh, Cancer. Um, some plans that you and your mate have made and um, they fail, but they will pick up in the future. And then you got the Seven of Swords. Going to be a lot of arguments and quarrels uh, this year, next year, within family, very much so. With a sibling, uh, spouse, or whoever. Watch who you take advice from, Cancer, because that shit ain't always true, who you take shit from. Um, the next card I pulled uh, for you, the last card, is Seven of Coins. You got a lot of anxiety. You're not patient at this time. You're very uneasy. There's lots of money. There's no money, or it's going out faster than it's coming in. And where you're living is very unstable. So this is for some uh, cancers, not all. Um, get your relationship in order. This is Born with a Veil. God bless.